Thanks for joining us as we welcome you today for Sunday afternoon football. Anthony Hudson joining you today. We are at Loftus Stadium. And joining me as always is Gary Lyon. Thanks, Hutto. I've been waiting for this game all week. Hitting the turf today will be the Eagles and Adelaide. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. Of course, Hutto. It's a big, big field battle today. Whichever team can get on top in the middle of the ground will walk out winners today. West Coast making their way onto the ground. The banners are ready for the players. Captains make their way into the middle for the toss. West Coast kicking to the right of screen. Round 17 and we're talking about who will get the prize double chances, who will make the top eight and dare I say it, Who's tanking for draft picks? If we look at the ladder, it's thrown up some surprises this season, and it's time for those sides to really prove themselves and lock in a finals position over the next few weeks. Can't wait for this one to begin, and I think the crowd would agree too. They are on the edge of their seats. And away we go, and a great bounce by the umpire. Quick hands, and they could be away here. Leach couldn't snaffle it. Seeds McCann balls. He's gone, unable to create the space. Walker going for number one. Hooks the kick. Deciding where to go with the kick in. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. The umpire will ball it up. Natanui gets onto the ball, gets a quick kick away. Shepard decides to soccer it. Goes off the ground. The ball's not loose. Just put it on the boot. He drives it towards goal. But he goes off the deck and nails the goal. Gets his first. His teammates rush over. The Eagles gets the first. We're back in the middle to resume play. Tap down. Shuey gets the ball. He takes the mark. Stepped off his line. Puts it on the boot. Good mark there. Kick by Gap. A great mark taken there. 35 metres out. Moving on. Going for goal number one. Ryan puts it through. Pretty happy with that one. The lead is now at 11. About to resume hostilities. Won the hit out. He gets his hands on the footy. Finds this and marks well. Moves it quickly. Gaff puts it on the boot. Marks all alone. Natanui doesn't want to let his teammates down with this kick. Can't cross it through. And only a behind. West Coast getting the fast start. Weighing up the options now. It's marked by Blair. He drives it. Brown found some space and marked. 
releases the handball, finds his man. He can take off after that handball. Marking in space for Kelly. Gets some distance on the kick. Hardigan leading the race to the loose ball. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Collects the loose ball. An easy grab for Gucci. Goes short by hand. Pushes through with power. Turned it over. Rushes with the kick. Drops the mark. Smooth collects it. McKay making his way onto the field. We'll get a stoppage. Natanui with the punch. Kennedy slams it onto the boot. Shoe able to release the kick. Getting in the way was Ryan. Blair must have double vision. Duggan with a penetrating handle. Go for goal number one. Congratulated by his teammates. West Coast could kick the last three goals. West Coast by three goals. Natanui having some trouble down there. Gaz, can you give us more on that? He's coming from the ground now. West Coast, but 19. Deciding where to go with the kick in. Talia plays on. Just gets a hand in. Smooth puts it into space. The umpire will ball it up. Barney slaps it away. Found time to get it on the boot. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's result. Going for goal number one. Drop that straight through the middle. Archie getting the crowd involved. 25 points the difference. That's a really good team game. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Umpire ready to resume play. Vardy slaps it away. With the ball now. Ball up in the centre square. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? There's just not enough effort out there at the minute. Shoe heads for home. Finds a target. Talia drives the kick. Brown takes the mark. Goes by hand. Missed opportunity with a handball. Hurried kick. A strong pack mark. Sinks the slipper into it. Gallucci looks to get onto the football. Nelson with quick hands. He gains possession. Going for goal number one. Tripp still delivers with the goal. They stretch their lead with that effort. Gets him reward for his efforts. That's five in a row for West Coast. 31 points the difference. Soccer's at forward. Brown goes off the ground. Rushes with the kick. Punches are clear. Proud with clean hands for a difficult bouncing ball. Massive kick here. They need to convert this opportunity. Adelaide close the gap to 30. West Coast have turned the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Slams it on the boot. A race for the loose ball. Thrashes it. Goes off the ground. Contests the hard ball. Sloan takes it well. He takes aim. Adelaide are happy about that one. Crowd love kicking that one. Adelaide behind by 24. We resume hostilities. Vardy won the duel. Hutchings gives the don't argue. Hardigan hacking it out of there. We're approaching the end of this turn. Hearn just too high with the tackle. Cole had it, lost it. Nelson gets in the way. Quick handball, missed the target. The umpire calls for it. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? 
I'd love for the coach to send a message out. West Coast are in the lead by 24. West Coast could have come out and started well and shown they have what it takes. The coach will be asking for more of the same for the rest of this one. Both sides might want to work on their defence after a high-scoring opening term. Gary, does anything stand out in the stats? West Coast have been extreme. Ready to go for the second turn. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. West Coast are in front in the clearances and it's allowing them to create pressure up the field and scoring opportunities. So what could West Coast do with this opportunity in front of goal? Ball spills, able to release the kick. Quick handball, releases the handball. Has a runner alongside him. Hurry kick. Shepard has it. Moves the ball by foot. Marks in a bit of space. A spearing kick. He gives chase to the footy. Browns gets the loose ball. Chips it towards half forward. Good body work to win the mark. Gallucci uses it by foot. Marks now and can send it back. Gibbs determined to reach the ball. Browse unloads one towards goal. He blasts it through for another. Look at him, he really enjoyed that one. Adelaide have kicked the last two goals. This game can still go either way. West Coast are making the most of their ruck dominance. It's one area of their game that seems on top here. Hot boot to ball. Archie hammers it at goal. Just couldn't get it to curve enough. The margin is 19. Players move as they look to provide an option. Handballs. That tackle just too high. Going for goal number two. He's put that one through. Barney making the lead bigger. Celebrating hard. The lead is now 25. We're back in the middle now. Nananui with the hit. Just gets it onto the boot. Ryan leaps over the top. Uses it by foot. Taken well at ground level by Glenn. Dishes it off. He has the ball. Smith gets streaming past and gets the footy. Picked up by Atkins. Takes possession. Walker comes away with the ball. Not sure what the problem is from here, but something is definitely wrong. That doesn't look good. I don't think he'll be coming back. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Great mark out of pressure. 50 metres out, Shuey with a pretty easy kick. Going for goal number one. Unbelievable effort, and it ends with a goal. They increase their lead. His teammates rush over. That's two in a row for West Coast. Now they lead by 31. Natanui finds possession. Doing well to intercept that kick. Chose to kick it. Hands that ball to the opposition. Rioli scoops it up. Rioli earns a free kick. Rioli has resources out wide, taking a nice grab. West Coast are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. He makes that kick count. Full price. That will settle the nerves. Gets his first on the board. This kick puts them further into the lead. Kennedy celebrates with the fans. We're back in motion. Swatson doing well was Hutchings. Fights the good fight. Receives the handball and takes off. He has to hold on to those. The ball mopped up. Proud hurried kick. And the mark will be paid. West Coast have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Barris tucks it into the pocket. The ball is kept in. Just put it on the boot. A good mark under the circumstances. Puts it on the boot. 
Open opportunity for Nelson. Got the hands free. Going for goal number one. Goal! He's excited about that one. Adelaide produced the margin. Centre bounce. Barty got a fist to it. Didn't fumble. Gets the loose ball. Just gets the hands free. The ball in the hands of Knight. We'll have another ball up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? There's not enough effort out there at the minute. Opportunity for Cole. The umpire will ball it up. Big thump from Fardy. Fogarty. There to mop up. Shoot. Elects to kick. Kennedy. This is it off. He gets his hands on the footy. He takes aim. That kick just beyond. Now they lead by 32. West Coast are costing themselves with turnover today. They need to find a way to control the play better and stop turning it over. Collected by Hearn. Going for goal number one. Oh, what a goal! Look at them celebrate that effort. 38 points the difference. The umpire set the bounce to restart the game. It's a turnover at full stride. Receives the handball. With the ball is McKay. That doesn't look good. He must be injured. Going straight to the rooms. Does not look good. An ideal position to be kicking from. If they kick this, they give themselves a chance. Lee couldn't be happier with that goal. Margin in a really tricky situation. Vardy clears the contest. He gains possession. Just gave it away. Hearn breaks the tackle. He has the ball. Big Clears the contest. Is in his possession. Gallucci handballs out into space. Wins the race to the ball. Going for goal number one. Summed it up. Perfectly. They're right back in this one now. He celebrates hard after that. Adelaide close the gap to 26. West Coast are controlling the position and they're using that control to hit the scoreboard. Half time and it's West Coast 58 to Adelaide 32. A good first half from West Coast. They can be well pleased with how the game is shaping. Vardy, second half action about to commence. Back with another centre bounce. Natanui thumps it forward. A chance for Clone. Gathers it now. Quickly onto the boot. Good mark and looks to send it back. Looks to move it by foot. Good grab there for Kelly. The Eagles haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Scoops it up. Duday quickly onto the boot. Doesn't hold onto the mark. Hardigan hacks it out of there. Walker marks uncontested. Gets the handball away. This is Crouch with the ball now. Hits the target by hand. Dishes it off to a player on the run. The loose ball scooped up. He goes for broke. Collects the loose ball. Kyle just put it on the boot. Good body work to win the mark. Redden sends one up towards the wing. Yo gets on the end of this. Ball off hands. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Gibbs moves it now. Jetek needs to lift. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to him and give him some instructions. Driftline to go through for a Unable to take that opportunity. Adelaide reduced the margin. Searching for a teammate. Plays on to himself. The kick from Barris. The ball ends up going to ground. Decides to soccer. A chance to soccer it and kicks the goal. Fogarty enjoying that goal. That's three in a row for Adelaide. They're finding a way back into this. 
about to resume play. Thumps it clear. Ends up with Chewy. Gibbs, hug it out. Gives it to Glenn. Going for distance with the kick. Great control there. He gets another possession. He kicks it out, and the ball will be coming back. Fogarty coming off for a spell. Kicks it out of the back 50. They chase after the loose ball. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Adelaide behind by 18, considering the options on the kick in. The mark has been taken. West Coast are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Lynch just throws. Nelson pops the play on. Takes the mark. Elects to kick. A race for the loose ball. Mops up the loose ball. Kicks hurriedly. Laird just gets a boot to it. Intercepted. Schofield throws the ball away. Smith kicks it. Finds himself in space and marks. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. West Coast forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Ball hits the deck. McKay clears the congestion. Seedsman picks up the loose ball. Going for goal number one. A good mark under the circumstances. 15 metres out. Move it on. Going for goal number one. They get around him after that effort. That's four in a row for Adelaide. Margin within touching distance. Natanui thrashes it. Yo creates all sorts of problems for his opponents. Great tackling technique. Off the deck. Kennedy dug out the loose ball. Lobs the handball. McKay links up with a chance to run. Had plenty of the ball. Finding the loose ball was Barris. Nice mark under pressure. Chips it towards half ball. Duggan sets his sights on the goals. 50 metres from home. He decides to go for home. Collecting high fives now after that goal. Of course, Hunter. Duggan celebrating hard. Ominous signs for West Coast. Three goals up now. We're back in the middle now. Punched away. He wins possession. He's got the footy in his hands. Goes for territory. Yo, works one on the boot for goal. Can't take the mark. Fancy footwork, and it's a goal to achieve. Smiles all round. West Coast starting to break away. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. West Coast have allowed the opposition more of the ball, but aren't allowing them to score from those positions. They are defensively very sound. Scoops up the ball. Has it now. Smith gets on the end of that handball. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. Great crack! West Coast just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside the... Knight enjoying that goal. Adelaide now only trailed by 18. It's been a clearance game, and right now, West Coast go on top in that area. Duggan just threw it. Moved on by Crouch. Dug out by Jetta. Goes by foot. Ryan has a great set of hands. 
West Coast have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of the game if they're to stay on top. Atkins bobs the handball. Smith goes with the kick. Keys takes the mark uncontested with a driving kick. Finds the loose ball. As we go to the final change, the scores at West Coast 70, Adelaide 52. A big final term coming up. The Eagles fans are we hoping they can hold on and get a memorable victory today. Vardy, the number one ranked player on the ground. He's the most dominant. Last quarter action, ready to go. Oh, they've got to take some risks now. They can't afford to waste any time. Thump by Natanui. Slams it onto the boot. Couldn't take it. She puts on a buff. Shows some physicality. Gets a quick kick away. Schofield hit the man hard. Schofield to get the free kick. Heard marks in a bit of space. Walker needs a chance to rest. The contest, no match for him. Yes, Hutto. 50 metres from home. Goes for the goals. Drop punt, finds its way home from Lynch. He's enjoying that goal. Adelaide could kick back-to-back -back goals. Adelaide, reduce the margin, needs a bit of a rest, gets it out of congestion. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Shepard tries to gain some territory. Knight sees off the tackler, puts boot to ball. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. You're right, Hanno, he's gone missing lately. That goal is a cracker. Lynch hunts through his third for the match. He acknowledges the crowd. Adelaide have three in a row. Adelaide close the gap to Tix. Natanui won the hit out. Natanui just threw it. Proud goes for territory. He gives chase to the footy. Going for goal number one. That's something to smile about. He just loved that one. We are all tied up now. Thump clear. They can create from this. He's got the football now. Kelly soccer's a kick. Atkins gets right in his face. Beautiful tackle, Hanno. Collected by Cardigan. Talia just gets it out of the boot. Gibbs will be upset with that. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. He needs to find a way into this game. Manufactures a handball. Chips it towards half forward. Hacking it out of there. Takes that one strongly. Rioli with the opportunity in front of goal. 35 metres out. Channels a long kick. Intercepts the ball very well. Decides to kick. Marking in space was Atkins. Goes with the kick. Talia got under it. Moves it by foot. It's a foot race to get this one. It's a big stage of this game. Hammers it. He has the ball. Fends off the tackler. Talia is screaming past and gets the footy. Looks up with the kick. The mark is taken by Hutchings. He drives it. Fogarty over the top. Stabs at the kick. McKay uses the body well. Not sure if he has the journey from here. Does well to cut off the kick. Elects to kick. Nice work for Kelly. Chose to kick it. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Hearn gets the handball away. The free kick has been paid. Talia kicks it. Nice hands. With a driving kick. Seedsman goes off the ground. And the umpire says, my ball. Winning it was Fardy. Prouse grabbed it clean. A 
makes it somebody else's problem. He'll get the free kick. Yo, coming on. He doesn't want to let his teammates down with this shot at goal. Gallucci might run around to open up the angle here. He likes his chances from here. Adelaide lead is now one. Looking to bring it back into play. Barris lays it to himself. Works the ball up the ground. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Uses it now. Crocker runs after the ball. Lee wins the foot race. Shepard brings it out of the pack. Coughed up by Gav. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Well, he hasn't had the impact we were expecting. He wins possession. Fogarty dominating this game. Yes, I know. He's a class act. Wants to keep it moving. Is in his possession. Lee found time to get it on the boot. They could take the lead here. Kennedy celebrates with the fans. They're in front. Umpire ready to resume play. He gains possession. Can't take possession. Handball finds Rioli. Picks up the loose ball. Found a way to keep balanced. Has a runner alongside him. Doing well was Fogarty. He lays off the pass. Intercepted. Gaff found a way to mark that one. Goes by hand, hands that ball to the opposition. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Going for goal number one. Takes the chance and says, thank you very much with that goal. Natanui loved kicking that one. West Coast have kicked the last two goals. The lead is now 11. It's great to watch, Hado. Plenty of excitement. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Adelaide could be winning enough of the ball to hit the scoreboard. If they're better with their efficiency, they can turn this around. Adelaide were back at the day as a performance they want to learn and move forward from. What were your thoughts on the match, Gas? It's just a bit of class that sets them apart today and a bit more polish when they needed it most. That's why they walk out here. Thanks for that, Gary. Final scores are 82 to 71. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. It was great being here, Hutto. I can't wait for the next match. We stick together through thick and thin. We grow as champions from within.